Let's begin today's Vanguard news with Borsha Road actually supporting two non-anime decks by giving two new cards for Otavisor and three new cards for Lascaria and EZBT05. Nova Grapple Arena Permafrost is a set order card, while in the order zone, lets you rest itself when your unit attacks, while you have a Rotovisor Vanguard and you haven't rested another arena order card this turn to give the attacking unit an auto ability that lets you pay 3 energy when its attack hits to draw a card. The main problem with Rotovisor had is that it could only play their set order on their second turn. So why the hell is this card grade 2? It just doubles down on the deck's problem. I guess Rotovisor can't get a grade 1 set order unless it has a bikini clad researcher waifu. Trab and Rotovisor once per turn while on rear guard lets you pay 3 energy to change your auto visor vanguard's original auto ability cost to one counter blast and while on rear guard you can pay one soul blast when it stands by your grade 3 or higher auto visor vanguard's ability to stand any number of arena cards in your order zone then you can pay one counter blast if you stood three arena cards with this ability to give all your front row units 10k power so this card changes glanzel's cost from two counter blast into one counter blast and three energy but then you can pay one soul blast in order to pay another counter blast thus defeating the purpose of the first skill just so you can get an extra 10k power and the privilege to either pay three more energy to draw or actually regain counter blast or energy this deck was supposed to be about cool giant robots so why the hell are we getting an analogy of how the bank system tricks customers into taking out a loan and paying interest the Lino Soldato Derobe when placed on rear guard gets 10k power. If you have a grade 3 or higher Lascari of Vanguard and you have another copy of this card in your drop zone. I'll give this card one thing. It's a good revive target with Melial or Gridola's abilities assuming you have at least two of them in the drop zone. The Lino Familia Floor Tree when discarded from hand during your turn. Let's you pay one soul blast if you have a Lascari of Vanguard to call herself to rear guard. This is just a quick way to get a Villino card on rear guard in the early game by using her as ride deck fodder. Villino Soldato Lefanohela when placed on rear guard lets you pay one counter blast if you have a Lascaria Vanguard to add up to one Villino card or order card that isn't a Regalis piece from the top 7 cards of your deck. And while on rear guard during your turn, she gets 5k power if you have 3 or more Villino cards on the field. While the card itself is good, it feels as though Borsha Road had put minimal effort in actually giving Lascari a new support due to how simple this is. Finally, we get the new Reziel's full name being, Fated King of Miracles Reziel Vita. Vita! And unless this new Reziel will have an ability that regards it as the original Reziel, you can no longer use Liel Immortal with him anymore, since she requires a Fated 1 card to work. And this card is a fated king. And that concludes this vanguard news without the bullshit. Special thanks to my Patreon members for continuing to support my content creation. Be sure to subscribe and let me know in the comments if Trab and Rotovisor should open a bank instead of fighting in an arena.